Okay, so Mortal Kombat 11 has been out a little bit over a month, and IGN, which is one of my favorite gaming channels, I have been uh, big with IGN. I love their reviews on games, and I respect them. Uh, they, they have come up with the their favorite fatalities uh, in the game. Now, uh, this is involving their community, the IGN community, uh, which compiles the reviewers and people that play the game a lot, probably more than we do, uh, and this is their opinion. Now, uh, the warning, this list will be controversial because we have our favorite characters and we feel a certain way about them. Now, IGN, like I said, this report or pretty much this uh, article was written by Clayton Petrius. So if you want to get at him, get at him. He just did it today. Now, these are the Mortal Kombat 11's best fatalities ranked and how to do them. So this is the best part about this list that, you know, they will show you, leave uh, the directions on what to press, what buttons and what directions on how to execute these fatalities. So. Uh, Mortal Kombat 11 features the series best and most brutal fatalities ever, but with so many to choose from, IGN has decided to narrow them down to the top 15 favorites. You will find them here in order from 15 all the way down to our favorite. The only ground rule we set no character could appear twice on the list. Additionally, we have included the combos for each of them in case you want to try them out for yourself. So without further ado, let's get started. This is the controls so you guys the link for this video is in the description so if you want to come back and uh, see what the correspondence for these directions are just click on the link so number 15 will be katana with the gornando I know a lot of people probably uh, love katana and I do I think she's dope number 14 will be Aaron black the death drop Aaron black is a favorite online <laughs> I mean people are playing with him non-stop the death trap number 13 is Baraka rock paper Baraka that fatality is something <laughs> to see it is gory so number 12 is Sub-Zero frozen in time Sub-Zero is my uh, favorite ninja of all time my personal favorite and I love this uh, homage that he does count it to the original fatality. He still love pulling spines. What is it with you and these spines? But I think it's gory. <laughs> okay, and number 11 is Jade, the pole dance. Jade also has a pretty good uh, fatality if you haven't seen it. I like this one. I think Jade will kick your ass. Anybody that want to staff, get out with her. Like, staff versus staff, I think she probably would win. Uh, Scarlet, bloody mess. Number 10 on the list. Do I agree with this? Uh, yes, because this is pretty gory and uh, you have to see it to believe it. Number 9, Frost, the Ice Sculpture. Uh, this, is, this was an unexpected fatality to me and it's pretty cool, to say the least. Number 8, a Noob Saibot, the split decision. Absolutely. Noob Saibot has probably he could be on this list twice yes this is gory and you have to see this one uh, because I don't want to mess it up with people that haven't seen the fatality but once this happens uh, echoing his dual personalities by splitting his opponent into four quarters uh, Cabal is number seven with the roll rash I love this fatality this uh, shows a lot of speed and is also reminiscent of the flash uh, special move from injustice how the flash just goes from one side to the other of the world uh, those who played the game know what i'm talking about so cabal uses a burst of speed against his opponent's face to reach the number seven spot scorpion you're next an instant classic from the first mortal kombat 11 trailer scorpion spears his way through his opponent face into spot number six here is pulling back Top five now, the bloody cream of the crop at five. Gear is pulling back, which will let you see what that means for yourself. Centrion maintaining balance. Centrion has two of the coldest and best 
fatalities in the game. Either one of these would have made top five in my opinion. Uh, she used all the elements at her disposal, finishing her opponent in two ways before dealing a finishing blow with three long earthing blades. Number three is Kong Lao, Meat Slicer. Deadly meat anyone, Kong Lao knows his way around a meat slicing hat with the number three spot. Number two is Jackie Briggs, nothing but neck. So, Jackie Briggs take the number two spot with perhaps the most creative way to split an opponent in half. And number one is Devora new species so the top spot goes to the one fatality that gives everyone the creepy crawlies every time they see it divorce new species if you have any semblance of arachnophobia stay away from this one so there you have it people that those are the top fatalities in mortal kombat 11 what do you think like this video leave your comments and subscribe later